This one goes out to all of my calculus scholars. Let's find some local extrema. A local maximum is a point on the graph that is above all of the points around it in a given interval. Let's call its x-coordinate c. We can imagine this as the top of a hill, but a local maximum could be at a corner, cusp, or even as a removable discontinuity, as shown here. Notice that at the top of the differentiable function, the tangent line is flat. Its slope is zero, so f prime of c is zero. For all other cases shown here, the the derivative of the function does not exist at x equals c. When either of these two things are true for x equals c, we say that c is a critical number. But what makes a critical number the site of a local maximum? Notice that to the left of a local maximum, the function is increasing. The tangent line slopes are positive, and so is the derivative. To the right, the function is decreasing. The tangent line slopes are negative, and so is the derivative. So if the derivative changes from positive to negative at your critical number, you have yourself a local maximum.